All right, and we're underway. Here we go. Big boys. Big boys. Yeah, hey, man. Right into it with a collar tie from right. PGL veteran Alan Wright defeated uh, Pat Stano in his uh, last one with a broken foot. Yeah. Actually, broken ankle or broken foot. I can't remember, but it was it was taped up and swollen. Locked up in the middle of the ring here. Both of these guys, tough, tough fellas. Yeah, and plenty of experience. Both, like, like we said, both MMA and in uh, and in uh, just submission grappling in general. Right in the uh, black and red rash guard, green and white for Barish. Barish looking for that shot. Didn't really change his level, so he uh, actually just ends up pushing right into the corner, right with a, like a three quarter Nelson. And he's looking to nice. circle off of the sea, using the ring exactly how he should. That's looking great. to circle off here. His foot's off the, off the ring. Yeah, and he's going to, Barish looking to Beautiful. lift it up. Man. Alan Both Wright's of them. A, Alan Wright's a big guy, man. It's going to be difficult to try to throw him uh, around here. That three-quarter was, was beautiful. It, it was. I'll tell you what, it was borderline neck crank, and he had it so uh, so deep there. But props to Barish. He just tried to barrel right through it. Yeah. Again, ring combat champion, Barish. That's Looking the way for to, that. Yeah. That's the way to do it. Just compete, compete, compete. Oh, all the time and everything you can. Looking for an Uchimata there. Goes down right. Allen back in bear shop. Underhook for bearish. Wrist control for right. I wonder what the weight difference is, these guys. Yeah, I'm not sure what they weighed in at. Allen does look significantly larger. Okay, it keeps going for that sweep. That Uchimata. Again, Barish is looking for that underhook, though, so every time Bright's going for it, um, every time he's, he's going for that, every time Barish does that underhook, you know, Wright's actually using that to try to take him down. Last 10 seconds of the round. And we're going to see a second between two guys, two big guys, Wright and Barish. Right, pushing him into the corner. Pushing Barish into the corner there. Barish circling out. Again, Barish being a you know MMA fighter, he knows knows the uh, to circle out and all that. Again, right pushing. Barish into the opposite corner now. Trying to snap him down. There it Barish is. Barish looks for the shot. Comes up with that single. Yeah, he good. I'll tell you what, good. he stayed with it. That's the way you got to do it. Yeah, even after Allen sprawled, as soon as he was standing up, Barish just followed and kept getting that, uh, kept that single. Yep. Man, there you three go. Man. quarter again. Just Jeez. pushing that head down, man. It's just yeah. difficult to do anything. Shoo, man. That's his corner's calling for. Get that yep. get the hand off. Right back up. Still, the attempt's got to count for something. And coming back up with that single. Wright's got to look to get a double unders, lock hands, and just you know use that power and then size. Yeah, I mean, he's keeping with the head and arm here. Yeah, you're right. I would like to see him. With, there you go. Would like to see him get these double unders, man. Like maybe a body lock or something. Yeah. Looking to arm, maybe like a Russian arm drag here for, for Barish. 
And a lot of times when you get oh, when you get two guys who who uh, are used to tying up like that, and that's their in, that's their way to get in. Sometimes and it looks like this. Good at it. <laughs> Danny looks for that inside trip or inside uh, sweep there with Uchimata. Barris charging in. Yeah, other than that one single, nobody's really committed, committed to it to a takedown here. That's why it's been on the feet. Ten seconds left, second round. Barish got him pushed up against the ropes. All right, all right, round three underway. Right, Barish. Man, this one's gonna be hard to call too. If this goes the distance, this one's gonna be hard to call. This has gotta hit the ground. There's a sense of urgency yeah, with both of them. You can see it. Barish push, pushes right up against the ropes here. Both guys, corners, feeling the urgency. Working for that inside trip, right. Good job reversing. Corn. These guys have stayed standing up straight. You know, they really need to change their level, and, and somebody's got to get lower than the other guy. Yeah, I mean, when they go for that, you know, a, even attempt a shot like that, they just got to really change that level and get lower. Right driving Barish into the corner. Last minute and a half in this heavyweight super fight here. Somebody's got to go low here. Yeah, Allen's still okay. There we go. See, I mean, he's bent over like that. You know, Wright's just way too strong to be able to take down like that. You know, he, he, you have to change your level below his hips. You know, just bent over. Wright's a big, strong guy. It's going to be, you know, very tough to take him down like that. You know, Wright go for that Uchimata again. Yeah, I mean, he's attempted it three or four times. Last 30 seconds here. Be honest with you, a takedown would win it here. Barris driving in. Barris is really trying to take him down, man. You know when he gets that that um. There you go, man. A little momentum with it. Trying a leg trip here. Last ten. You know. I would like to see this action in the middle of the round, you know what I mean? Now yeah. we get to the end, but here we go. We're going to go to judges, uh, judges' score on this. You know, sometimes you just get those opponents where you guys are just... Matched up perfect. Yeah, and you got the same game plan, you know?